Hey y'all, Bill D, Hall of Fame Collector here. I think this is video number four of the Trimming the Fat PC video. Um, hope you guys watched the first three. Uh, just random, I have these in no specific order, just kind of how it is in the pile here. These things are all for sale. The email is in the back. Um, again, first dibs to you guys seeing this on YouTube before I finally have the time and energy to put it on Instagram or eBay or what have you. So, uh, I'll start off with, uh, I just ended off with some really sick patches, and I guess I'll continue on with some really nice patch cards. That was this one. How about a Paul Molitor, number one of 20, super patch. That's a Jackie Robinson patch card. The shine is beautiful. This one I love. Tom Glavin. Trading swatches, it's called. And this is the parallel, the harder one to get. It's numbered to just 10. Uh, this parallel is dual patches. So you have a really super thick Atlanta Braves patch and a really super thick logo New York Mets. This card is just unreal. We have here some, uh, oh man, look at this one. 09 Ultimate Patch to 35. Lou Brock, I think this is upside down, but it is your, I think that's, just, that's for Cardinals, I guess. But yeah, the, the, look at the fabric. Um, this one too is sweet. Number three of five, Clayton Kershaw, Los Angeles Dodgers, future Hall of Famer, legend. Uh, 09. Super Patch, Rod Carew. This one's just absurdly amazing. Uh, upper Deck Game Used Baseball. Roger Clemens. Now what makes this Game Used Baseball card really cool is that it's an official World Series ball. Game Used. All right, here's another patch card. Tribute, you never see these guys. Um, a jersey piece, game worn uniform, Ty Cobb with a, with, a, with a pinstripe, look at that. And this happens to be numbered uh, to 425. Uh, can I find some more patch cards here? I have a few. Oh, all right. Ripken, tops tier one, number to just 10. Giant, uh, what do they call this? Prodigious patch. Look at that. It, like, it's just unreal. And you want unreal. Uh, trust me, it's real. Leaf Q. 2015 they put barrel pieces of Babe Ruth on cards look at this number five of five authentic bat Babe Ruth this is a barrel piece not just a bat shaving in the middle the outside of a bat barrel piece bam authentic bat during his years with the Boston Red Sox All right. Uh, all right, we'll just do some more here. Basketball. 06, 07, Ultimate Signatures. Dennis Rodman. The Worm. This guy has a pretty good following in the sports card world. Game Changers, 35, number 35 to 35. Tracy McGrady, T-Mac. All right, here's a Leaf Metal, Ann Myers. Again, this is the Refractor on card, the 50. All right, Johnny Bench. Epic Signatures, this whole set's going away. Beautiful blue ink. 
This here is an Ultimate Patch 09. Good luck finding something this big of Sparky Anderson, legendary Hall of Fame coach. Look at that. This one was really cool. Um, I have a video going back when I got this card. Uh, Luke Appling, Hall of Famer. Uh, Legends card number to 10. And you're sitting there wondering, what is this from? This is from like an old timers game. Um, and I have posted the video of him wearing this jersey and he hit a home run. And he was like, I don't know how old he was, 70, 80, I forget. But he hit a home run. And I had that video. Um, just put Luke Appling old timers game or something in YouTube. And you'll see that he was wearing this jersey. All right, another patch. Don Sutton, 35, Hall of Famer. Mike Schmidt, Epic Signatures. Beautiful ink. Kurt Schilling, on card autograph. He'll be in the hall. Trust me, 3,000 uh, strikeout club member. How about two non-baseball, non-basketball autographs that I just decided to pick up out of nowhere? Um, future Hall of Famer, if, I guess, yeah, future Hall of Famer, Peyton Manning. Yeah, unless he's in the hall. I, I couldn't even tell you I'm not a football guy. But look at the ultimate signature. Love that little foil. And it is numbered to 50. I think that's the gold version. And one of the best hockey players of all time, inscribed to Mr. Hockey, Gordy Howe. Uh, let's go 90s. Let's take a break and go 90s. All right. This is a... Uh, 90s card, number to 5,000. That's gold, studio stars. This is another 98 Ultra, gold medallion. Ken Griffey Jr., some sparkle to it. Here's another Prism, hollow gold. Number to 480 on the bottom. Here's the uh, other version of that Griffey. And this one is, uh, I think it's the 10,000. Yeah, limited edition, one of 10,000, it says. All right, there's this card, numbered to 399. Here's a uh, Pennant Craze Griffey, Leaf Limited. This is Felty, and it's die cut. And it's numbered to 2,500. All right, 97 Platinum Press Proof. The big unit, Randy Johnson, to 150. Crazy for 1997. Here's a gold medallion, Griffey. Gold medallions are one per pack. Uh, Leaf 97, 24, 22 carat gold leaf stars. Number to 2,500. Super beautiful shine. Diamond Tribute 96 Fleer Griffey. Look at that. And this is a monster. Essential Credentials. Frank Thomas. Um, this is the uh, Essential Credential Future. Look at this. This is a big car, guys, for 90s collectors. Big card, multiple layers. Just this card's beautiful. Number to 109. All right, how about Griffey? This is still in the initial thing. Uh, Prism 2014 Griffey on card die cut mojo 25. This card is not easy to get. Epic Signatures Juan Gonzalez. The silvers were short printed. Tim Raines, Hall of Famer, Tribute. Here's another Prism Distinction, 
Uh, this is not the Mojo Silver. This is uh, on card from Nolan Ryan. This is a purple. The purples were numbered to 75. Or no, is that 99? 99. This is a rookie card reprint, on card autograph of legendary Ernie Banks. Beautiful. Looks like his rookie card, which I believe this to be 54. All right, flying through. Lou Brock. Epic signatures, Ernie Banks. Prism Distinctions Mojo 25. Look at that. Straight up 90s style. Frank Thomas. And the 2000 Legendary Signatures Thomas. Oh, my back hurts. Bob Gibson, Epic Signatures. Uh, this one, again, I showed my, uh, I showed the uh, Tom Glavin of this. Trading Swatches this is, again, the hard one to get, number out of 10, uh, like a Prime or whatever. Oakland and Boston. Super thick, bulging out of the card packs, uh, patches. Eckersley. Here's another card, uh, patch piece that's just bulging out of the card. Number to just five. Rick Farrell. It's amazing. We have a basketball Lisa Leslie index card, Hall of Famer. We have a George Weiss, executive, Hall of Famer, cut, basically. This is a monster autograph for Hall of Fame collectors. Monster item, uh, cut autograph of Mr. Chuck Klein. Look at that. Chuck Klein, good luck finding him. Super expensive. PSA DNA slabbed. Chuck Klein. All right, here's a government postcard. Ralph Kiner, best wishes Robert. I showed this guy off a few times, the same collector, Robert Ohms, uh, 1949. Here's another one too, he wrote again to Kiner, Ralph, Ralph Kiner, government postcard. Bob Ohms again. This one seems to say 1950. Here's another government postcard. Best of everything, Bob Lemon, pitcher. And on the back, James Davis, 1947. All right, here's another Bob Ohms. Uh, government postcard, I, it might be 1950, it's hard to read. Uh, legendary pitcher, the Lefty Grove. Look at that. And how about a... William H. Bill Terry, government postcard autograph. Love the ink. Love how neat his autograph is. That is 1948. Here is a another government postcard. Robin Roberts. All right. There's the back. 1950. Yeah, I'm almost at the stretch here. Who likes Barry Bonds? Because I think he's a Hall of Famer. And I think I have his card right here for you. And it's available. There's an odd card autograph of Barry Bonds with a jersey piece. Uh, and it is numbered to 400 on the back. We have a Jim Rice. Greats of the game, on card autograph. A Louis Aparicio Tops tribute. Look at that blue ink. Number to 50. This is a, uh, if you're looking for an on card autograph of every Hall of Famer, you're going to need one of these cards. I happen to have two. It's from 1983 ASA. Again, I showed him Willie Mays that I'm selling from this set. Uh, Johnny Mize. This is the only on card certified autographs that he 
Signed, 1983 ASA, numbered out of 2000. Here's a guy that I think had a shot at the Hall of Fame. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen now with things, but beautiful ink signature of Carlos Beltran. And Hall of Famer. Bobby Cox. All right, guys, I'm sneaking these last few cards here because um, I didn't realize I forgot this little pile. All right, but nonetheless, amazing cards like this one. Uh, throwback Threads, Joe Torrey, Prime. Look at that patch. Torrey with the 61 there. That's a ridiculous wool. Um, patch uh, numbered out of 25 Jim Tomei prime patch is 2005 this was an excellent set because it told you what it was from so no fakes authentic game room jersey laundry tag look at that gorgeous at 23 uh, here's a here's a card I pulled as a pack out of a pack, Carlos Lee, great player back in the day. Patch prime to 25, but what's cool is he has the his nickname, El Caballo, the horse. How about this uh, Billy Williams, Cooperstown card, on card, Hall of Famer. Uh, look at this one, monster card. Look at this perfect signature. Ted Williams, upper deck. Look at that. With the UDA. Uh, I think this also has the, um, the little booklet that comes with it from UDA. It's a gorgeous card. You got a Matt Williams tribute. On car autograph. And this. Sweet Spot Classic Billy Williams Hall of Famer Super Patch. Look at this thing out of 52, but you can see there the I don't know if you can tell. You see the blue with the pinstripe crazy patch. Um, super thick card. Look at that. Very cool. And the last item here, you can see me. Hello. Is this uh oh I don't know what it is. 16 by 20, maybe. Uh UDA. Numbered out of 104. Uh, autograph of Sir Charles, Charles Barkley. Look at that. Really nice item. Again, this is, uh, I picked this up when he wasn't signing sports cards, but uh, it is UDA and uh, Charles Barkley, the man. So, no joke, this is the stuff that I'm going to get rid of and trim the fat. It's a huge pile of things. Just amazing items there. Um, if you're interested in the Sam's Coke, that's available too. Um, but anyways, Bill, the Hall of Famer. Here's my email address. And uh, listen, if you guys can spread the word that I'm selling some stuff here, um, that'd be great too. Uh, I'm sure there are people that don't follow me that would love to see what I have available. Um, again, I just got married. And uh, I'm trying to make, uh, just trying to weed out the, the fluff in the collection. It's just too massive. So thanks you all for watching. Take care.